Caught on video, a man walking into a local gas station and then punching the clerk several times, knocking him to the ground. Well, now the sheriff's department is asking for your help to identify this guy. Our reporter, Riel Creighton, is live in San Marcos with these breaking details. Riel. Yeah, police tell us the victim was uh, just released from the hospitals despite suffering some severe injuries, including bleeding on the bra brain from a severe beating that he took inside this gas station where he works. We want to show you that video, but a warning, it is graphic. This is what happened. This is from last Wednesday, September 28th. You see a man walk inside seemingly unprovoked and immediately sucker punch the clerk. Then what looks like a scuffle that happens outside of the frame, the clerk falls to the ground and then the man kicks him in the head. The clerk motionless on the ground as that man simply walks out of the gas station. Police also provided video that shows what happened right before that. A woman who they described as the suspect's companion who was with him is inside that gas station buying beer moments before the attack. There's no audio, but it's what looks like a pleasant conversation that happens and then she walks out. Investigators tell us they want to find this woman also, not because she's a suspect, but they want to talk to her in the hopes of tracking down the man who she was with. He's described as an African-American man between 20 and 30 years old, six foot tall, weighing about 185 pounds. He had long dreadlocks and was wearing a yellow T-shirt and black shorts. Now, I spoke to a detective in this case. He says they have no motive. Nothing was stolen. Even the clerk, he says, doesn't understand why he was attacked. We're live in San Marcos. Riel Creighton. 10 News.